My intellect is without limit. Stacks back. School face MTG. So you might be wondering why I have on two pair of glasses today. It's because I have double vision. And no, it's not because I smoked some good strain of sativa. Well, I did do that, but that's not why I have double vision. <laughs> I'm playing a double vision deck today. Uh, somebody, this was a deck, well, this was one of the cards that somebody challenged me to make a deck with. They challenged me to do something with double visions. Um, so I did that. And after much frustration and deck testing, I finally came to a list that I like and I feel it's viable enough to put out. Um, this deck, it is not for someone who um, has trouble piloting. This is not an autopilot type deck. Um, this is a moderate to high skill level type deck. So um, if you're if you're one of the players that just likes a deck that's just going to autopilot and just auto get you wins, um, this is not the deck for you. So keep that in mind. This is a very um, high to moderate to high skill level type deck. Um, your decision making is very important in what you choose to do um, with this build. So, um, but it is a lot of fun though. Um, a lot of people don't expect double visions. They don't expect to see double visions and a lot of people don't even really know how to react to it. They don't know what to expect. So um, it's, it's oftentimes they just sit there and just let you do what you're doing just so they can see what it is you're doing. So uh, yeah, let's get into the deck. Uh, I got three shock, three anticipate, four growth spiral. Uh, yes, this is a teamer build. Um, a lot of times people will see that they'll see a growth spiral and they'll think you're on a team of reclamation build or, you know, a team of ramp in the Ugin type build. But and so they kind of sit around and they wait for that and they anticipate that. And before you know it, they you just kill them because you can just kill somebody. You can bring somebody from 20 life all the way down to zero in one turn with this deck. Um, but yeah, back to the tick. So four growth spiral, four flame spill, three cultivate, two drawn from dreams. Four Storm's Wrath, four Double Vision, four in Inescapable Blaze, four Electro Dominance. Uh, for the lands, I got one Castle Vantress. I, had, I did have two, but it kind of made it feel kind of wonky a little bit of time. So if you draw multiple Castle Vantress in the early game, it can sometimes throw you off. So I could have down to one, but um, you might want to test it out with two because Castle Vantress is really good in the deck. Um, three Island, three Mountain, three Forest. Two Steam Vents, one Temple of Epiphany, three Stomping Ground, one Temple of Abandon, three Breeding Pool, one Temple of Mystery, two Ketra Trium, and two P Fable Passage. And then for the sideboard, I got three Flame Sweep, four Slaying Fire, four, uh, two Mythos of uh, Bad Drop, two Rao Is It Viceroy, three Chandra's Incinerator, and one Expansion Explosion. There's no creatures in the main deck. I love building creatureless decks that don't have creatures in the main board because you present a deck to your opponent that doesn't have creatures. So if you're playing best of three and they see you don't have creatures in game one, then a lot of times they side out all their creature hate. So then you bring in Chandra's Incinerator and um, it's just kind of like, whoa, what, what just happened? Now he has creatures. So um, that's typically how I would do that in best of three. Um, very similar to the Teferi deck that I made, uh, the Mill deck where I didn't have any creatures main board, but I have two dream trawlers in the sideboard. So you present a deck in game one that doesn't have any creatures. It will make your opponent, a lot of their creature interaction that they have in their hand will just be dead draws to them. So they side all that out after game one, and then you side your creatures in from your sideboard into game two or three or whatever you want to do, and it throws them off. So I like building decks like that. Um, like I said, this deck can kill out of nowhere. You'll see in the gameplay, I'm playing with some of the sideboard cards in the main board because I wanted to do thorough testing um, with the main board cards and the sideboard cards. But the main deck, this is what I came to the conclusion that this is the best build up for going into game one. And then once you see what your opponent has, is you go ahead and go into the sideboard and pull what you need. Um, Ral is really... <laughs> your opponent, they, and once you get, if you side in Rao and you play him, your opponent really, really throws him for a loop then because they really don't expect that. I mean, throwing in Chandra's Incinerator is is the same thing really because they they don't expect any creatures. So if you once you play an Incinerator and they they've sided out all the creature hate and then it's they really die. 
So, but a lot of times it doesn't even come to that. This deck is very explosive. Um, once you get double visions out, um, you can pretty much just go ahead and end the game. Um, the turn after you get double visions out, if you so choose to. Uh, I like this because it's very viable against a lot of flash decks. Flash decks are really heavy in the meta right now. So this deck, it holds up against flash decks very well because it's a lot of instants. And you got to always keep in mind that uh, if you, Electro Dominance is an instant. So if you're going up against a flash deck, and a lot of times they're just going to sit there and wait and see what you do. And if you don't play anything, then they'll go ahead and flash in a creature. Well, when they flash in a creature, you go ahead and play Electro Dominance, kill their creature, and if you have a Double Visions in your hand, you cast a Double Visions um, and get it into play so they can't counter it. So, you know, the deck has a lot of different options if you play it right. Um, but like I said, once you get Double Visions down the game, you should be able to end the game rather quickly after that. So, enough talking about it. Let's get into the gameplay. Uh, not a lot of action, but... I'm gonna try it. I like this triome. So pretty. I need these in foil. Dr. J. About to put that slam dunk on me. I'm ready. Get dunked on. Anticipating it. <laughs> um, you know, take the vents. This uh, infamous team of reclamation, Doctor J. Go ahead and cultivate. No sense of holding these in my hand. Teamer versus Teamer. Yeah. You're playing the meta. I'm not. Um. I think. Just go ahead and cultivate again. Reduce my. Oh, I thought he was going to counter it. <laughs> Reduce my chances of drawing lands. Alright. Yeah, mountain in. All right, so Team of Reclamation, he's, he's going to be sitting on counter spells. We all know that. So all I basically got to do is, wait a minute, I uh, think I'm going to play the temple. Yeah, all I got to do is, uh, I don't. I don't think I'm gonna need Storm's Wrath. See if I can get this to resolve. Maybe it'll draw a counter out of his hand. No? Alright. Take the Electro Dominance and. Do I want both of them? No. I think the Flame Spill is probably okay here. Um. Because if I can get double vision down, then Flame Spill can kill his Euro. Oh, I got to discard. Uh, yeah, get rid of that. Now he knows nothing of what is in my hand. I suspect he's got at least two counter spells in his hand, though. Alright. Um, go ahead and pay for this, and uh, I'm just gonna pass. We gotta play the waiting game. Gotta play the waiting game now. See what you people do who play counter spells. Who want to play counter spell decks? Make the games boring. We have to wait. I now have to wait to kill you. All right, Doctor J, you're not, you're not dunking, you're not doing very many, uh, very much dunking here. 
Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do anything. I could, I could go ahead and I'm gonna, I'm gonna electro dominance here, since he doesn't have any blue open. Yeah, I'm gonna electro dominance and get my double vision down. Oh yeah, six to your face. And I'll uh, play my double vision. So he can't counter it. Um, go ahead and play my Fiend Vince and I'm going to pay for it here. And uh, play my Dawn, my Drawn from Dreams. Counter one if you'd like. It's fine. A counter it. Counter one of. I dare you. Oh, I'll return my my double vision to my hand. All right. That's perfectly fine. Um, I see he's got a breeding pool up up there, so that that means he's he's probably got mystical dispute in his hand. So I will not be casting my double visions. Alright, uh Electro Dominance and Storm's Wrath, I guess. Now Storm's Wrath, it, it kills Hero um with double vision. I'll take this in blaze. Take both blazes, I think. Yeah, because he can't counter these, so. Um, yeah, I'll just take those. And I'm going to have to discard. I'll just discard my lands here. Um, no point in me playing anything because I know it'll just get disputed. All these lands. Dr. J, why do you have to be playing counter spells? So boring. What are you doing? Are you contemplating? You have nothing to fear. You're at 20 life. Not for long. I'm gonna flame spill is a uh, fairy here. Take three to your face. Got a pump? No. <laughs> oh man. Alright. Uh just pass. Just pass. You can't use your castle ventures. You don't have another blue. What are you doing? I wish he did, because that mean he'd be tapping all of his blue mana and I could Play stuff. <laughs> Another reclamation. All right. Uh, I think I just want to. I want to. I want to just give him a blaze to the face here, just to start getting his life total down. Um. Let this resolve. And, uh, yeah, that's fine. He can't counter the blazes anyway, so let me just go ahead and give him one to the face and put him at 11. Can't counter it. I know you want to, but you can't. Hurts, huh? Hurts. <laughs> uh, let me go ahead and try to shock. You can counter this. Put some cards in your graveyard for, for Euro. Because if he goes for Euro, if he goes to, if he goes for Euro, um that means he's gonna be tapping out his blue mana, and then I can just kill him. Yeah, that's fine. 
Yeah, he he. If he goes for the Euro, then uh, let me see. Yeah, cause he's only got two blue. All right. Um, I'm just gonna pass. If he goes for a Euro, he dies. So not even, not even concerned. Gonna play a Euro. You're afraid. You're at eleven life. Afraid I'm gonna burn you some more. Oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. You're about to die. <laughs> oh. Go ahead and uh let me see here. Uh electro dominance for what is it here? One, two, three, four. Five, six, and seven. Yeah, electro dominance for seven. And then I'm gonna cast in skip plays for free. <laughs> ah, <laughs> get out of here, man! Stupid reclamation. Yes, I had fun. Ready, ready. The biggest Nim. Cool name. I'm gonna shock myself here. So I can anticipate. Hello. The biggest. Oh. Dread Horde Invasion. I did not anticipate that. <laughs> we'll take this flame spill. <laughs> Alright, uh go ahead and cultivate. Hit my two mountains. Play double vision on time. Be good to go. Oh. Is this zombies? I want to do something with zombies. Like that. Alright. Get my double visions down. I imagine I'm going to eat some damage here. Probably more than I'm anticipating. <laughs> what you got? My son's in there having a good time. Oh man. Now you got a demonic zombie. Alright. Well, Electro Dominance goes for four now. So, alright. I'm gonna go four to the face. Four to the face, and then cast flame spill on the big zombie that's gonna bleed over for one. And then I'm gonna shock the little zombie. So two electro dominances to the face. That's gonna put my opponent exactly at six. Alright. Then Dreadhorde Invasion will zap him for one. They'll be at five, and Inescapable Blaze will finish you off. Yes, I know. Very nice. Oh, you're back up to six. Oh, man. How much life can you gain? Can you gain seven life? Put yourself out of kill range? No. <laughs> oh. Easy pickings. Easy pickings. <laughs> yes. Oh man, no green. Can't keep this. All right. Yeah, keep this. And I'll put back uh electro dominance. Electromatic static
We see a lot of black today. To anticipate for my land. Oh, underworld dreams. Uh oh. All right, cultivate. Get my two mountains. Oh man. Oh man. I gotta race these underworld dreams now. All right. My double vision down. Oh man. The race intensifies. All right. Go ahead and get a land out here. Mountain. And uh, let me shock your Ayaro. Get her out of here. Firehound. Your your name is misleading. Oh man. Well might as well go ahead and try to draw into some wind conditions here. It's gonna cost me life drawing, but Gotta do what I gotta do. Well, this won't cost me life, so I'll keep that. Let's go ahead and flame spill your Ayara. I gotta outrace these underworld dreams here. Man, didn't need another Storm's Wrath. Go ahead and draw on from dreams. Take the, uh, let's see. Take a blaze. And I think I'll take a flame spill. And let's take a electro dominance. And guess a land. Cause I need I need my electro dominance to be at maximum power. All right, put this in tap. Go. I'm glad they don't have five mana. They can't drop a Gary. All right, I ain't worried about that. Go ahead and uh, unshock his face. It's a mighty shock. Four damage for one. Alright. I think I can go ahead and kill now. Pay, pay two life for this. And that's going to be Electro Dominance for what? One, two, uh, eight. Oh, no. It's uh, seven. Seven, seven. Electro dominance for seven. It's Fourteen. It's inescapable blaze. Caps it off. You almost had me, man. Almost. Do I want to flame spill his token just to be cheeky? No, he's already dead. <laughs> Neruswakwa. Very interesting name. All right, need some red. Give give Papa some red here. He's got red. I need some more red. Uh, well, that'll do. Just as good as drawing a red. Two two red mountains, two mountains, and no play. Are you playing big red? Must be. Are you playing my version of big red? The stacks big red. 
Chandra's big red machine. That'd be awesome if I ran into another one of my decks during my gameplay. Alright. He's definitely playing some variant of, of Big Red. But I know he's not playing double visions. Because this this deck has not been unveiled to the public yet. It has not been unveiled to the world. What you got? Oh, Bone Crusher. Followed by Shock, maybe? Oh. Well, I'm really wondering if this is my deck now. Alright. Dwarven Mine. I didn't have any of those in my deck. It's a good addition though. Um let's go ahead and get the tap laying down. And uh Do I wanna I'm trying to think here. Do I wanna electro dominance? No, I'm just gonna go ahead and clear the board. Just go ahead and be safe and sorry here. Don't try to get cute. Oh. Oh. Is he playing uh cats? <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and select three cards here. Flame sweep and another double vision. You have three. Never got three down before. Uh oh, dark on. No sword can pierce. Your end has arrived. Really? My end has arrived? No. I think your end is about to arrive, Sarkon. Um, <clears throat> what I want to do here? <clears throat> I think. Um, Electro Dominance for five. Copied twice. So, all right. Let's go ahead and Electro Dominance Sarkon. And Electro Dominance the Dragon here. Uh, I'm going to cast Double Vision. <clears throat> um, I'll fry your Elemental here. Cast Dawn from Dreams. Uh, take the Blaze and playing fire and anticipate How could I have lost? uh risk factor is good since I have three double vision out I think they'll just let me draw cards if I've cast risk factor if it mattered anyway they're, they're dead now all I have to do is cast blaze all to the face. <laughs> oh, why is it not letting me? <laughs> you get what you deserve. <laughs> oh, man. Waiting on Balrogs. Street Fighter. Balrogs. Balrog versus, go ahead and spiral here. Versus uh, Mike Tyson. Um, uh, don't need that. Balrog fighting Mike Tyson. <laughs> um, 
We're going to spiral. Man, where's the where's the mountains? Go ahead and fetch one up here. You got. I see an interplanar beacon. Should have known. Very. Go ahead and anticipate. Um, we get the stomping grounds. Got to get rid of Teferi. The fairy throws off the game plan of this deck. We pay for this and get double vision down. Cause he can't bounce it with the fairy. I've got time. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna keep this. I'm gonna I'm gonna cycle that. I don't need any more lands. Uh, I think I just. Slaying fire to fairy for now. I think that's probably the Cause I don't want a storm's wrath. I don't I don't know if he's running creatures, so yeah, let me just go ahead and slay him fire. To fairy. I'm gonna do both at the fairy in case he counters one. Pretty sure he has a counter spell in his hand, so defeat all right and I'll uh, just hold this up bell rock with all these counter spell decks coming from all right I'm going to cycle this well whatever shenanigans you're trying to get to uh, let me pay for this. And since he's tapped out, I could slam fire to the face right now. Hmm. Which one do I want to do? I think I'm just going to escape the blaze to the face. Go ahead and get his life total down now. And uh, if he plays anything, then he'll die. Uh, if he doesn't play anything, I'll cast Slaying Fire, and uh, he'll have to he'll have to try to double counter. All right. Uh, yeah. Let me just pass. <clears throat> so if he if he counters the Slaying Fire, then I have Electro Dominance. Finish him off. Yeah, let me go ahead and fire to the face. Adamant. Wanna counter it? Face. I know you got a counter, man. You 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 have to. You're playing to fear. You have to have counter spells. You're not gonna go out this easily. All right. Now you die to electro dominance. Electro dominance for five. It's a good try, man. Counter this. <laughs> Add to insult. Another another double visions. I'll opt. <laughs> I want to opt first. Got everything I need. Joey and the Beanstalk. Are you playing Beanstalk Giant? I like Beanstalk Giant. Especially when I have lots of land. He's really good then. Could be possibly running Beanstalk Giant. Any green lands up there. Alright, Spiral. Triome. I really need to get some foil triomes. Commander. Keep that there. Crap.
probably like, what is this? Reclamation? No. It's much worse. Much worse than Reclamation. Alright. Go ahead and get Vision down. Play your Beanstalk Giant. I know you have one. Do you have one? Please tell me you do. I think it I think it's very cool if you do have one. That's not a beanstalk giant. His name is Domery. What else you got? You disappoint me. You're not playing beanstalk giant. Alright. He's definitely not a beanstalk giant. Um. Well. Could just go ahead and clear the board now. Or I could wait and be greedy. Do I want to be greedy? No, being greedy is not good. Being greedy costs you games, so. I'll be back after I've licked my yeah, bring Beanstalk Giant back with you when you come back. I'd like him to join the party. Joey up there. He didn't. It's not Beanstalk Giant. Alright. Oh, uh, go ahead and pay for this. Um uh, I could blaze the the board now, but I'll just wait. I'll just wait. See what he does. Don't play anything else. Alright, let me go ahead and blaze the board before he attacks. Um, playing Groove, so he may have pumps. So I think I need to send both of them at the board. I didn't think about that. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do both at the board because if he pumps the board and keeps the board and attacks with him, that's gonna be bad for me. Did not think about that when he was tapped out. It's okay. Okay. I was too busy uh, wanting Beanstalk Giant to be here. Alright. Uh, pay for this. And short of anything. Oh, I'm gonna forge. That's weird. I expect to see that. Short of anything of something with haste and. Embercleave, he just dies here to electro dominance. Looking for Beanstalk Giant? No. Oh. I was hoping to see a Beanstalk Giant at some point in this matchup. But Joey here is letting me down. Keeps playing all these not Beanstalk Giant creatures. All right. Well, since you let me down, I'm gonna have to kill you. These primitive decks. Good game. <laughs> He's saying good game back. <laughs> he probably thinks I'm saying good game because I think I've lost, but quite the contrary here. Go ahead and cast slam fire. Go all at your face. Uh, decline. Been nice knowing you. Should have brought Beanstalk Giant. I would have probably let you live. No, maybe not. <laughs> Roast. That's how you dominate. The double visions. Electro dominance. Make your opponent see double. By roasting their eyes. <laughs> oh, as always, I hope everybody enjoyed the gameplay. 
If you have not, please subscribe and hit that bell. You definitely should do that. Um, like, dislike, whatever you want to do on this video. Go ahead and comment. Please engage on this video. It helps out the channel a whole lot. And again, this was a submission from one of my viewers. They wanted to see Double Vision. So if you want to see a deck with a certain card, let me know. Comment down below. Send me an email. Do whatever you want to do, but let me know. As always, appreciate everybody. See you all next time.